welcome back to another video. Today is a brand new day and I'm basically fixing the net. So I got a net, the metallic net I didn't speak of. This is it. Very solid. Uh, yeah, so I'm fixing that in addition to the outside light. So that is what I'm doing as it stays now. The process involved is basically measuring the size of the window and then cutting the net. There's a special cutter that is used to cut the net, which is over here. So I've actually done for the back window, that's the kitchen. So this is the uh, second one I'm working on. Uh, the window size is five feet. And that of the one over here, which is this one is, um, uh, it's the height is three feet and then the width is four feet. So I'm done with this and I'm also done fixing the outside light for it as well. So. I'll be doing for this window and then after that I'll do for this. That has been installed. Um, here it is. Yeah. That has been installed and I did the installation by myself. So let me just run you through um, this net and the cost of it, where to find some and how to go about it. So this net is mostly sell, sold by those who sell some of these aluminium um, products. That is the profiles and the rest and then the glass and the rest. These are, so I got this from a company known as So Far Me. Yeah. So far me, so far me. Yeah. There's a branch at, I think, um, close to Achimota. There's also some at around um, Agboba, yeah, in Accra. So this is sold in meters. So one meter, which is the height is four feet, is um, sold for, the, the width is one meter, the height is four feet. I think they also have five feet and uh, more. It's sold for 120 cities, yes. That is expensive. Honestly, so for this entire house, we needed a total of seven meters or 7.5 meters. That did cost 900 cities. So for that was just for net. Yes, I did the installation myself. So I saved about 300 cities from um, that. Um, it took me, no, like uh, I think a day. It wasn't enough. The net I got earlier, I got six uh, meters. It wasn't enough. So I was left with one window and then I got the remaining one and then I finished with that so it took me let's say two days to do the installation aside the installation of the net i had to purchase also ceiling buttons um, which is this and then um put that is you know yes so this particular wood it was very very hard in it so all the nails were just burning yeah i was, I was able to get some um going in smoothly but this one the middle one was very very tough so that's just about it for that. So I got a ceiling buttons also, which aid in um, being able to put it on top of the net so that you know you don't have the edge showing. So it's securing the edge of the net. So I've done it for the entire house. This is the side, the bathroom section, and then when you come to the kitchen area, the kitchen section as well. And then that is this is the bedroom, so the other side, and then the hall, and then the yeah, so the hall as the last part so for this net it is um, cut with a special tool so there's a cutter or a cutting tool that is used to cut this net so the process involved for being able to install this net was basically measuring the size of the windows um, and then measuring that on the net and then cutting with the tool so you see some of the videos of me cutting and then also installing it um, here unfortunately i didn't have gloves as at then so if you're going to be working with this net you need to be very careful or else you might end up injuring yourself because of the sharp edge so i ended up having some bruise here which is i think it's even gone so yeah you need to have gloves when you're going to be working with this or else you might end up hurting yourself so i did cut and i was able to do the installation with the help of a hammer which i used to you know nail the nails into the wood I also use a um, tape measure which aided in the measuring of the, the net and then I use a cutter, a special cutting tool to also cut the net and then for the wood I use a saw to, that is a cross cut saw to cut it, that is after measuring, getting the edge um, the way it slanted and then I went ahead to install it so I didn't really take so much time to 
um, install it. I was able to do this with a bench that we have here. So I stood on it and then I went about to um, install the net. So this is, uh, you might be wondering why did I go in for an expensive net? Well, this is more or less like a lifetime solution where you wouldn't have to be changing net over and over. The nets are, um, are polished, so it's not like the raw net which is going to rust. So these are polished nets where um, it's not going to, you know, experience any form of rust. So that is how I went about installation of the nets. The total cost was 900 CDs, and I did transport them here myself. I went about the installation myself, which did save me about 300 CDs. And then I bought a ceiling button, about 10 pieces of that. One was five CDs, so that was like 50 CDs. So 950 CDs was the total cost for this including the nails the nails i did buy one and a half inch and i bought one pound for that that was 10 cities so the total cost was 960 cities for the installation of the net so that'll be about it for this video in case you have any questions just go ahead to drop them in the comment section and don't forget to hit on the bell and if you have any support for me of course i'm open to it thank you very much for watching i'll see you in the next one